Welcome back to Houston Life. Trade Day is this weekend, and it is the 15th anniversary of an event that brings a lot of good to our community. Wow, 15 years, huh? Mel Camp is out in Avia Stadium with the man himself, hometown hero Trey the Truth, getting all the details. Hey, Mel. Hey, Lauren and Derek. Yeah, we have been hanging out, me and Trey the Truth, and just, you know, checking out the space. Trey Day is happening this weekend. So many things are going on, but this is where the family fun day is going to be on Saturday. Definitely, definitely. The official biggest family fun day in the city, Trey Day Live at Aviva Stadium slash Sabercat Stadium. It's a moving machine already, so they know it's you know it Saturday really from 3 to 8 p.m. Yeah, so there you go. So when you see Sabercat Stadium, don't get confused. You come into the right place <laughs> where yeah, you've already come, man. always. All and right, so let's talk about it. It's going to be such a huge day. Yeah, it, well, it's going to be a huge weekend well, yeah. just in general, but this day is definitely the most important because, you know, all the kids get their school supplies, their backpacks. I bring snow. I bring animals, um, bounce houses, stage music, celebrities, carnival rides, cars. Um, man, it, it's a lot. You know, we're giving out scholarships, a, a bunch of different giveaways, blessing a few families with cars for the heat so they won't have to be walking with their kids. So it, it's a lot going on. This is huge. I mean, this all started a long time before 15 years ago, but 15 years ago, the 22nd of July was dedicated as Trey Day. From there, you've used all of your, like, philanthropy energy. I mean, you do so much good in the community. You always have. And now you've turned this into such a massive event. What do you think when you look at how big it's become? Uh, it's, it's a blessing, man. Sometimes it's always surreal because you never really think, like, coming from where we come from, we would reach levels and reach peaks that, that we reach. And um, fun fact that you probably didn't know, for the first 10 or 11 years, it was just the 22nd. Now Trey Day is actually the um, 21st, 22nd, and the 23rd. And then this year, is it going like one bigger to the 24th? Uh, <laughs> it's possible. I mean, right now it's just it, it's understood it's Trey Weekend, man. Okay, so, okay. You know. But you might be hearing something more, and then you can go, <laughs> oh, we heard that on Houston Life. Yeah. But look at this. This is a huge space out here. Um, we have some, it looks like one of the Sabercats is practicing, but yeah. this is going to be full of people on Saturday. Yes, definitely, man. Did you and say snow? Did you say there's going to be snow there? Yeah, I always, I always do that because, you know, in Houston, it never snows. So every year, well, that's one of my biggest things to make sure we bring snow so the kids can slide down the sled and do other things. And the other thing is we do know it's a lot of heat, so we come well prepared. Um, it's going to be trunks of ice and water scattered all throughout the um, whole stadium. Um, we're looking to bring mist machines and other stuff, man. You know, we want to make sure people help first and foremost, but on side of that, just have a good time. You know, this is the one time of year they know they can depend on, well, for those who don't have the money to get supplies or things that they need, they'll actually be able to get it. How important is a weekend like this where you are celebrating the community and you're reaching out to kids who maybe don't realize how much, how close they are to their dreams? Uh, it's, it's very important, man. That's the, reason, that's the reason why I bring the celebrity factor, right? I bring celebrities um, from movie stars, singers, rappers, comedians, athletes. I bring them here because some of these kids only see them on TV, social media, YouTube, they never had the opportunity to actually be able to touch a person in real life or be there to hold a conversation. So when I bring them here, it also motivates the celebrities to go back to their towns to do the same thing that I do. And at the same time, it motivates the kids to know, hey, I can be them or better. And you know what I'm saying? I'm just the same as them. So it's one big circle that I bring together to make it work. Do you reckon you have to be famous to do good? I mean, that's a, that's a... No, nah, because, you, you know, it's so crazy because I, I still never really, me and you were talking off record, like, I still don't classify myself necessarily famous because people always be like, man, you act normal as can be. So I, I, I tell people all the time, man, sometimes it doesn't even take money to help people. Sometimes it may just be that shoulder for them or that ear that they need or just the words of encouragement or wisdom that they may need, man. This, being famous and not famous matters not, you know what I'm saying? Because if I if I wasn't a rapper, I wasn't as big as I was, I would still be doing the same because it come from the heart. That's amazing. What happens if you lose your phone? I mean if you've got you got that Rolodex. 
<laughs> Do you put people on your phone in code? So if you were to lose your phone, people wouldn't know who they were? No, nah, it won't be that easy to get <laughs> in my phone. But, um, yeah, I, I never thought about that. You know, that, that's, that, that's something different. Well, you know, I got it backed up to the extent because my phone to capacity, man. But uh, hopefully we never have to come across that problem because on the side of the numbers, my music is on my phone. I have over 2,000 unreleased records. Oh my gosh. Now, I'm, I wish I didn't say it that at all. I hope I didn't jinx you because we need your music. Yeah, we definitely. need the magic that you do here in Houston and all of your connects. It's so great. Just name a few of the big names that are coming that you think you know people should definitely know about. Um, everybody be of the weekend from T.I. to Rick Ross to Waka Flocka, um, you know, Tiny will be here, Yandy Smith or Estelle. Um, man, it's when I say so many people, like, I don't even want to go to name and people forget. Uh, oh, forget someone. You know what I'm saying? This, and, is, this is a testament to you and all the good that you do for Houston and for people. And so just thank you so much for nah, being an awesome human here in Houston and doing good for the community. I appreciate that. Um, I make sure I'm going to post the itinerary so things start kicking off Thursday. For me, they already start kicking off every day this week. Me and Bell Furniture are going to bless a home with um, we fully furnishing homes. We did yesterday when I leave from with you, I'm headed to go surprise another family. We're doing that every day. But Thursday, everything kicks off. The first event is Bam Bams are going to be our first um, annual Bam Bams pet cool-off. So we'll be at the, I believe, Market Park downtown. It's a pet park. And we bought a bunch of um, pup cups so everybody can bring their animals out there. Of course, got to be friendly. We don't need no mean animals, but, you know, um, bring everybody out there so all the the dogs, everybody cool off, get them their little ice cream, their little stuff they need. Uh, we got a special needs event, special needs bowling event with my son Danico's Unique and Gifted Foundation, the big bike ride. Um, last year it was thousands of people. This is going to be the second annual. We'll do that Thursday. Um, then, of course, we have parties Friday. Um, we're taking over the senior citizens' home where I'm blessing them. We got the Women's Empowerment event that's going to be even more amazing. And I don't know if you ever heard of Comedy Roast. They're going to roast me Friday. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about that. <laughs> Look at that. You do all this good, and then you're going to put yourself out there to be yeah. roasted. I want to, I want to see that. that that's, a, <laughs> that's a special segment for the haters. So if they ever wanted me to be talked about, they can have their fun that day. Um, that you just give to everyone, whether it's the community, the haters, everyone. You're amazing. Trey the Truth, thank you so, so much for being with us here, coming out into the heat and showing us all this is just one of the events for the Trey Day weekend, yes, yes. for the Family Fun Day. This is happening on Saturday and we're going to post all the details for everything and links that you'll need on HoustonLife.tv. So go to the uh, Scene On section and you can find that easily. Shout out to everybody back in the studio. You know they my family too, man. Much love, for real.